Welcome back to Cardboard Box Finance, the channel where we delve into the captivating world of economic history and uncover the lessons that shape our understanding of the financial landscape. In today's video, we take you on a journey through one of the most intriguing financial crises in American history, the Panic of 1907. Join us as we explore the intricacies of this pivotal event, unravel its causes and consequences, and gain insights into the measures taken to stabilize the financial system. Get ready to dive deep into the dramatic events of the Panic of 1907 and discover its enduring impact on the American economy. The Panic of 1907 was a crisis that shook the very foundations of the American financial system. It began with the failed stock market cornering attempt by F. Augustus Heinze and culminated in a wave of bank runs and a liquidity crunch that spread fear throughout the country. But amidst the chaos, a group of influential figures led by J. P. Morgan emerged to restore order and prevent a complete collapse. Their actions would shape the future of financial regulation in the United States. Join us as we examine the events leading up to the panic, explore the chain of events that unfolded, and analyze the far-reaching consequences. We'll delve into the key players, the economic dynamics, and the impact on businesses and individuals. Through this historical journey, we'll uncover the lessons learned and the reforms that were implemented to prevent future crises. The Panic of 1907 serves as a stark reminder of the vulnerabilities of unregulated financial markets and the importance of crisis management. It highlights the need for effective mechanisms to maintain stability, restore confidence, and safeguard the economy. By studying this pivotal moment in history, we can gain valuable insights into the fragility of the financial system and the measures taken to prevent its collapse. So, grab your metaphorical time machine as we transport ourselves back to the dramatic days of the Panic of 1907. Join us as we unravel the complexities, analyze the responses, and explore the long-lasting impact of this significant financial crisis. Together, let's learn from the past to navigate the present and shape a more resilient financial future. The Panic of 1907 was a severe financial crisis that unfolded in the United States and had far-reaching implications for the country's economy. It was characterized by a series of events that led to a liquidity crunch, bank runs, and a widespread loss of confidence in the financial system. One of the primary triggers of the panic was the failed attempt to corner the stock market by F. Augustus Hines, a prominent copper magnate and speculator. Hines sought to manipulate the price of shares in the United Copper Company, in which he had a significant stake. However, his scheme failed, and as the value of United Copper shares plummeted, it caused panic among investors. The panic intensified when the Knickerbocker Trust Company, a prominent bank in New York City associated with Hines, faced a run on its deposits. Depositors feared that the bank was overexposed to risky investments and might collapse. As news of the run on the Knickerbocker Trust spread, it sparked a wave of bank runs throughout the country as depositors rushed to withdraw their funds from other financial institutions. The widespread bank runs and the resulting liquidity crisis severely strained the financial system. Businesses faced difficulties accessing credit and the shortage of available funds further exacerbated the economic downturn. As the crisis deepened, stock prices plummeted, leading to a sharp decline in wealth and widespread financial distress. In response to the crisis, a group of influential financiers led by J. P. Morgan took decisive action to stabilize the situation. Morgan orchestrated a consortium of bankers who collectively pledged substantial amounts of money to support troubled banks and restore confidence in the financial system. This intervention helped prevent further bank failures and alleviate the immediate crisis. The Panic of 1907 had a profound impact on the American economy and prompted calls for financial reforms. 
Recognizing the need for a more stable banking system, efforts were made to establish a central banking authority. This ultimately led to the creation of the Federal Reserve System in 1913, which aimed to provide a more robust framework for managing monetary policy and ensuring the stability of the financial system. The Panic of 1907 serves as a critical case study in financial history, shedding light on the vulnerabilities of unregulated financial markets, the consequences of speculative excesses, and the importance of effective crisis management. It also underscored the need for mechanisms to prevent and mitigate future financial crises, leading to significant changes in the regulatory landscape. By examining the events of the Panic of 1907, we gain valuable insights into the interplay between financial institutions, investor psychology, and the role of influential figures in shaping the course of economic events. It remains a pivotal moment in American financial history, reminding us of the enduring significance of prudent financial regulation and crisis response in maintaining a stable and resilient economy. As we conclude this captivating exploration of the Panic of 1907, we hope you've gained a deeper understanding of the intricacies of this crisis and its profound implications. Remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay informed about our latest videos. Join us next time as we continue to unravel the hidden narratives and untold stories that shape the world of finance. Until then, stay curious and keep exploring the fascinating world of economic history.